Welcome everyone to a special video I like to call, accidentally causing unnecessary drama between YouTubers for no apparent reason other than misunderstanding. I'll work on that title. But for real, not here to add to the manure pile of drama. Just my own opinion of the guy in today's inevitable copyright strike. Fuck you MLS I'm going to be explaining my experience with Pi Realm Gaming. My experience with him was neither good nor bad but I feel like some points worth noting. First off, he is genuinely very easy to contact on Discord. So props to him for that. But that's where my experience of him happened. You see, I DM'd him letting him know that I have made an expert's guide. Now I had spent a few days working on this expert's guide and had actually put a lot of effort into it. But unfortunately, I was quite sick at the time and also I wasn't, and still am not, very confident with voice acting. So this led to my voice being quite garbage in the video. So he lets me know my voice was garbage. Fair enough I thought, so I remade it with text to speech voice. Which mind you took all night because the free version of the text to speech software kept crashing and it wouldn't work properly which led to me getting annoyed and missing a fuck ton of spelling mistakes for so I missed an entire night's sleep trying my best to make the video look good and work as best as I could get it. He then replies with this. Oh yeah that's right he didn't watch it and this is what mostly annoys me, because I put all I could into this video to make it the best, but in the end he was just too busy with airsoft that he was just overwhelmed by videos. Correct me if I'm wrong but not a lot of people actually made one, right? I mean it's not that hard to sit down and watch a few videos right? Well. Oh shit getting back on track. After me linking the two experts guides I have made, he then replies saying that he is adding them in chunks whenever he feels like it. This is what gets me the most. People are taking time out of their day to make videos for his series and are not even getting paid. Well most of them. And he doesn't even add their contribution to the playlist. This has also led to a lot of confusion where people haven't communicated with each other and made the same experts guide. Because I check Pi Realm's playlist to see what new additions have been added. And when I realized he stopped adding them I got really confused. Also Pi Face. It doesn't matter if they're lazily edited. Because what you might consider lazy editing might be someone else's hard work in trying to put effort into a video that is potentially going to be seen by a lot of people. I mean, with one exception being this one. Like come on just at least use text to speech. But that's just my experience. Overall, I just think he overwhelmed himself when he asked the entire GTA YouTuber community to make videos for him. Thank you for watching and enjoy your day. Vice. Yeah, baby, I just kept turning night, but she wondered what it's like to live for all these down my eyes. eyes. Yeah, but I gotta catch a flight. Yeah, I wish I had more time. time. Vice. Yeah, baby, I just kept turning night, just but she wondered what today. it's like to live for all these down my eyes. eyes. Yeah, but I gotta catch a flight. Fly. I wish I had more time. time. Hop out, watch out, I don't care about cops now My head drop me